Hi there, this is Anub. Today we are going to talk about easiest image editor, the best image editor option that you have when you are browsing through any websites and you see a image. You want to make some markups in that image and send it to your colleagues, etc, etc. What is the easiest way to do that? There are different ways, copying that image and pasting it into a full-blown image editor and then editing it or use MS Paint, the Paint tool, a lot of options. But the easiest way that you have when you're browsing a website and you see a wonderful image and you want to make some markups in that image and send it over. That is what we are going to see today. Microsoft Edge browser has a built-in image editor in it. That is what I'm going to demonstrate in this video. So don't skip it. Let's go ahead and watch it out. So let's check how to edit images directly from Edge browser. You don't need to open MS Paint or any other picture editing software. Just need to open the website or in the Microsoft Edge browser and right click on that particular image. Okay, This is the image I'm talking about. Now I'm going to edit this image. So right click on this image and select edit image option over here. Once you select that you will get a editing window over here with all the functionalities. Over here you can see save, reset, undo, all those options and then over here you can see crop option and adjust option filter markup options and you have option to zoom in and zoom out etc etc if you look at the bottom of this editing screen you can see again there are different options flip image vertically that is the option for this and then flip image horizontally this is the option for that and then you need to click on this button if if you want to see more aspect ratio options for example something like this different social media platforms if you want to share this image in Instagram or some other social media platforms you need to have a special aspect ratio that is what you can see over here then if I click on this it will just flip the image as you can see over here horizontal flipping option as well it will be like this and you can undo it if you click on this particular button or you can press ctrl z from your keyboard that is also available so we talked about many options okay so you can rotate the image that is option for this that's really good now let's look into these options crop is the default option got automatically selected then you can say i just wanted to crop it to conditional action I don't want anything else you can crop it and you can say okay I want to save this two options are there copy to clipboard and save if you want to save it as a PNG file you can do it as you can see got saved into your download folder as a PNG file otherwise you can just copy it to clipboard and then open paint and paste it over there that is also very much feasible now if you click on adjust option of over here there are different options you can adjust the light settings brightness exposure contrast highlights shadow all these things you can adjust with this menu option see brightness you can adjust exposure you can adjust and then contrast you can reduce increase all those things you can do highlights shadow you can make a shadow all these options are there and under the light there's an option to check the colors if you go over here and check the color what are the color options let's check that saturation is there warmth is there and then tint these are the three color options available in this editor you can see it is changing the entire warmth is getting changed right it is getting warmer and tint is another option this editor is very powerful inside microsoft edge browser you can zoom zoom in if you want and you can zoom out as well if you want to reset it will go back to the previous the original picture so let's check that went back to the original picture when i clicked on reset there's option to filter now 
let's look at filter options a uh, various filter options available over here on the right side menu I'm going to click on black and white black and white cool black and white warm film all these options are very very useful so you don't need to install any specific editing software to edit images from any of the websites you can do it for the images from social media websites as well let's look at markup click on markup and over here you have an option to write something hdmd or you can say okay this is the ca policy ca policy for all these kind of markups over here on the left side of of the screen you can see the markup options such as if you want to highlight something in yellow you can do that there's an option to erase everything if you click on this button it will get erased remove ink strokes there's an option like that and then there's a pen option and there's a blue pen option also available it's really interesting this is pretty pretty useful very user friendly editing tool within microsoft edge browser I really like it to quickly edit the photos and make it a bit more attractive with markups etc. Now that you have seen all the rich features available in built-in Microsoft Edge image editor, there are various options to have a quick markups, theme changes, cropping options, all the adjustments, flipping of images, all those details you have seen in this video. Hope this was helpful to you around